Now, I have a lot of animals in my house, and I just thought to myself, if I had a life-threatening disease or if an intruder with a sickle came into my house, would they protect me? And the answer is absolutely not. So I looked up stories of animals saving humans to make myself feel better, and to hopefully make you guys feel better too. The first story is about how some lions rescued an abducted girl from kidnappers in Ethiopia. In June 2005, a 12-year-old girl from rural southwest Ethiopia was abducted by four men on her way home from school. A week later, as the captors tried to move her with the police in pursuit, three lions intervened. They must have actually heard about the Amber Alert and decided to do something about it. The lions guarded the terrified girl until the officers arrived, deterring her kidnappers. Despite being beaten, the girl was unharmed by the lions, sparking speculations that her cries resembled that of a cubs, promoting the unusual intervention. Now, I disagree that the lions wouldn't be able to determine that the little girl was a lion or not, but either way, those are very impressive Liam Neesons to have by your side. Now, I bet most of you heard about how dolphins are actually the little menaces of the ocean, but their hate for sharks saved this lifeguard and a family from a shark attack in New Zealand. In late 2004, lifeguard Rob Howes and his family faced a potential shark threat while swimming in Ocean Beach in New Zealand. Seven bottlenose dolphins displayed unusual behavior herding the swimmers together and fending off a great white shark. Marine experts suggest that the dolphins sensed the shark as a threat and exhibited altruistic behaviors, protecting the vulnerable swimmers. The next story is about a sea lion rescuing a man who jumped off the Golden Gate Bridge. Kevin Hine, struggling with bipolar disorder, survived a suicide attempt by jumping off the Golden Gate Bridge in 2000. A sea lion circled beneath him, preventing him from drowning. A passerby called for help and a rescue team arrived in time to save Kevin. The sea lion's timely intervention played a crucial role in keeping him afloat during a severe mental health crisis. Now, that's what I call a sign from God to give your second chance at life a little more care. Now, I'm going to ignore how many deers take humans off the census a year and focus on how this deer scared off an attacker and saved a woman in Oxford, Ohio. In February 2012, a woman in Oxford, Ohio faced a potential assault when a man dragged her behind a building. A courageous deer appeared suddenly, frightening off the attacker. The woman, aided by the unexpected intervention, suffered minor injuries but retained all her belongings. Sergeant John Varley, astonished by the incident, highlighted the rarity of such occurrences in his 17-year career. And it was on that day that Bambi became Batman to save the streets of Oxford, Ohio. He's not the hero we deserve, but the hero we need. The last story is how beavers provided comfort and saved an orphan boy in Canada. Real Gwindon, orphaned during a camping trip in Ontario, Canada, found solace with three wild beavers after his parents tragically drowned. As temperatures dropped below freezing, the beavers pressed against him, preventing him from freezing overnight. This heartwarming story showcases the unexpected compassion and life-saving instincts of wild animals in the face of human tragedy. That must have been the most comfortable and cutest blanket to have ever existed. It's almost worth losing your parents for that. Now, am I telling you to go hop into the lion's den and go hug every overgrown kitty cat that you see? No, absolutely not. But what I am saying is that animals are living creatures just like us, and that we should cherish them. Now if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and I will see you in another video.